Hey gamers, I am Cyber Snacks 7 hope we're all well and it's great to be back for my first video of 2024. Yes, it's been a long, long time since I've done a video, eight months to be precise. Uh, and to be fair, I'm glad to see the back of 2023. It's a complete washout year for me. With what went on in the background and my new job, um, it just gave me no time uh, to do absolutely anything uh, what I really wanted to do and enjoy. Uh, so, as I say, I'm so happy to be in 2024 and see the back of 2023. So I thought this is going to be my let's do video to get back into making videos video. Does that confuse you? Well, it's just to get back in front of the camera and just get some content up and uh, get myself used to sitting in front of the camera and talking to you guys yet again. As I say, it's been a while. Uh, a lot's gone on. Um, uh, and I'm going to make the most of this year, try and get some good content up for you guys, some good pickup videos. Um, obviously, what's gone in the room, because as you can see, the room has changed again. The arcades have moved. This is the final position for these things. Um, these are staying where they are now. As I say, the room is it's very small. It's compact, but I'm going to and I'm trying to make the best of this room. Uh, and this is going to be the final lot. Like, what it is is what it is now i don't know how many times i've said this before but regardless this is going to be the final rendition of the way the room's going to look i've still got a few things to do a few things stick on the wall i want a lot of nostalgia in this room uh concerning uh from my past uh, movie wise gaming wise things like that so you'll see and look at things and it will just remind you of uh, a certain time uh or like a time and place in, in, in my life. That's the way I want to look at this room. And um, that's the plan for the room anyway, to try and get it to look in that way, and uh, which I'm looking forward to. And I'm not doing too bad so far. I've got a few things changed around. I've got rid of a lot of games, um, not a massive amount, but just got rid of uh, stuff that I don't really need. My collection this year, I can guarantee you, is definitely going to change. It's gone back to... I don't know how many times I've said this also, less is definitely more um, concerning my collection. I'm definitely going to be, I've, well, put it this way, I've done a list. I've made myself a list this year um, of certain titles I want for certain systems. Uh, in, including, you know, just retro-wise anyway, I'll be sticking to certain titles uh, for each system that I, that I want to get for. Uh, in, Modern gaming, well, I'll just pick up a modern game, a Switch game or a PS5 uh, game whenever they uh, are released. So I'll, I'll probably do a video on, you know, there's the new latest game come out and do a gameplay video, whatever. I don't know what this year holds yet, so I'm just like getting this first video out and then just taking it from here. One video at a time. But anyway, yes, let's divert back to what I was talking about, the collection. Yeah, the collection, I'm just going to be... Uh, I've written a list of certain games I want for each system. Uh, that's the goal to try and get those games this year. That's my challenge. Um, there's also uh, four consoles I want uh, this year. Uh, one I want to get back into the collection. Uh, and the other three, well, we all know the Switch 2 is definitely going to come out at the end of this year. So that'll be on the cards. And then another two um, consoles to add to the collection, retro wise which you will see in the coming months. Um, so that's my collection. I, I'm, as I say, I've thinned it out. Um, I'm massively into my fighting games lately, so I've been picking up uh, a lot of Japanese PS2 fighters, even shooters as well, uh, which is kind of strange, but I'm really into... I picked up a ton of Switch, so there will be uh, a video concerning my Switch pickups. That'll probably be the first one I'll do. But as I say, I've got my Neo Geo collection to go through as well. Uh, an update on my Super Nintendo collection, uh, my Commodore 64 collection, uh, my Hit Squad collection, uh, my figures. I've, they're all changed, they're all different. So you'll see this in a room too when I get round to it eventually. I just might do a mini one to show you what it's like. And then as I progress and do uh, and add more stuff to the room, uh, you'll see in a video as I, I'll do just a little mini update sort of thing but um excuse me my throat's uh, very dry because this is the second time I've actually done this video um but I thought the first time was a bit mm, so I've just put a, put a bit more spark into the video because I was a bit like too laid back 
Uh, but um, I've got to be enthusiastic, you know what I mean? This is my channel and I want you guys to realise that I am enthusiastic about doing videos instead of giving, well, you know what I mean? And that's what I felt like when I very first did the first video. Uh, so I scrapped that one and I've done it all over again just to make it uh, a bit more cheerful, a bit more positive. And that's what 2024 is all about, positivity. Especially for me, I want to get out there and I want to uh, do some good content uh, and also get out to events this year. Uh, another thing I've massively missed. I think I went to one event last year and that was the Birmingham Gaming Market. Um, I really enjoyed that, but I want to venture out a little bit more this year. I did go to Blackpool, of course, as well, which uh, wasn't the greatest experience. It was, it, it just wasn't days of old, put it that way. Um, it was nice to see people and meet up with people again, but it wasn't like it used to be. And I don't think it, it's ever going to be the same again. It's a shame. Uh, such a great event back in the day, um, and it still is a good event. Uh, but uh, compared to the way it used to be. Uh, and the old old school YouTubers will know this. Um, it, it hasn't got a patch on the way it used to be, which is a shame. But regardless, you know, it's always going to be there every year. So I'm still going to go, maybe just for the day this year. Uh, I might not stay overnight. I'll just, uh, just go on the day, have a full day down there on the Saturday. But that's a definite. That's probably going to be a definite. But other events, more closer to the beginning of the year. I've written a couple down. Uh, one uh, I'll be going to is the uh, the Leeds game, uh, Gaming Market, uh, which is the, I mean, I've wished it down because my brains are sick. That'll be a Saturday the 3rd of February. Uh, so I'll be going down to Leeds, no doubt, with Mr. Condo Con Jones Delora. Get it right, Jay. Con Jones Delora. And uh, Craig's here again. Uh, so I'll be uh, jetting down there uh, for the day to go to the uh, Leeds Gaming Market. Looking forward to that. Uh, and then, of course, the big one, uh, which will be in June, and that is June the 8th and 9th, which is a Saturday and Sunday, which is obviously Revival Game Not Over events, which I cannot wait for. Um, I've missed the Revival event. Uh, it's been a good couple of years now. Obviously, Craig's gone through a lot, uh, and he's come out the other side, uh, and he's uh, definitely uh, on the up. Fair play to him. I'm really, really happy for him. Um, and he's really, really doing well. But yeah, this event, I cannot wait. Um, uh, as I say, I've always loved the Revolver events. Uh, and this is going to be extra special. As I say, it's been a few years. Uh, and it's the uh, Wolverhampton race course again. Where I think I think that's where it began. Uh, I can Looking back, I think that's where the very first time I actually went to the Revolver events was at the London, uh, London the um, Wolverhampton uh, race course. Uh, and they were fantastic days out there then. So uh, I think Craig's going to make uh, a massive effort for this one and make this absolutely amazing. And, you know, it's um, it's not just the event, but he's going to have uh, stacks of stalls. He's going to have lots of events going on. And it's going to be a great hub for gaming collectors and YouTubers alike to meet up and have a couple of fantastic days there and there. So I'm looking forward to that. In terms of other events... Uh, London Gaming Market, I'd love to go, but it's a Sunday. If it, if it did Saturdays, I'd, I'd be there, but logistically trying to get there on a Sunday is, it's just impossible. It's a pain in the arse, to be honest. So unless I do Saturdays, uh, that's probably a no-go for me, unfortunately. Uh, but you never know, never say never. Uh, hopefully, Dane still will do his Black Country Gaming Fair again in Brawley Hill. Uh, I missed the last two. Um, no fault of me, unfortunately. So if he does... I'll be the first to tell you guys the dates uh, and when it's going to happen. So looking forward to getting down to uh, Dancer's uh, Gaming Fair, hopefully, this year. And um, whatever other events happen, to be fair. I just want to get out and about this year, do a lot more uh, game hunting and things like that. Just getting out and meeting people and catching up with people again. I've missed it all. Uh, but that's event-wise anyway, and that's gaming-wise uh, room wise as I say I'm going to be like jiggery pokering and just adding stuff to it and making it look you know pretty cool I've got a good few ideas uh, I still haven't got my screen yet uh, for my projector TV which I've found one I'm definitely getting it but that's probably going to be the last item I'm going to get because it's it isn't cheap unfortunately but it's an, an amazing looking uh, screen so 
once that's in, I think that'll be the final piece to the puzzle as far as I'm concerned. But uh, yes, uh, looking forward to 2024. As I say, I'm going to just keep this nice and short. I just want to, uh, like, as I say, go over what's what, what I've got planned in my head. Um, the reality of it, let's see how it goes, 2024. Uh, you know, as I say, YouTube's in my blood, I've missed it. Uh, I'm still breathing. I say this video is here just to let you know that. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm just looking forward to 2024, having a good time. And, uh, you know, getting back to hopefully the way it used to be for me and YouTube. Just get on, do videos. Don't think about it too much. Just come up, put the camera on and just do a video. You know what I mean? I'm not here for, uh, like... Uh, production value and blah 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 it is what it is i put the camera on and i talk and i've never been any different and uh, hopefully you guys still appreciate it and enjoy it um and hopefully i'll get a, a few new subs this year It'd be interesting to get a few new viewers i need to get myself back into back into the uh the mix of the youtube community a little bit more because i have neglected it i haven't been around a lot um and there's a lot of people have come a lot of people have gone again from the youtube scene and um I think it's, it's going to be common now. Uh, all the old school, there's a few that are still hanging around. You know, they're still there, which I'm, I'm glad. Um, but uh, as I say, you know, let's just see how 2024 goes. Uh, and if it all goes well, then this channel continues. And uh, as I say, I'm going to put more effort into getting the videos up and um, some good content. And there's going to be some good pickups through the year. Uh, no crappy shelf fillers. I'm going to try and make these all hitters. That's what I'm saying. All big hitters. That's what I want. And um, that's why I'm going to keep it short, sweet, simple. Uh, even if it's one game, a video. But that one game, I'll look at it and think, <laughs> that's that's a big hitter. That's worth the money. I'll, 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 no doubt I'll pay over the odds for some games, but that's just the way I am. I've never been any different, but I don't really care. As long as I've got that game. And I, I can enjoy the game for what it is and play. That's the way I want it to be. Um, so, anyway, enough wafflage. Um, this video I'm going to bring to a close because uh, I think I've waffled enough. Uh, and I've got to get on with some real videos, some pickup videos. And uh, obviously, whatever videos come your way in the next coming months. So... If you're old school and you're watching, thanks for coming back and uh, into the you know, onto the channel and watching uh, this ugly mug again. Yes, my birthday, by the way, today. And uh, uh, I am even older than I was, put it that way. Um, but regardless, um, I'm going to have an enjoyable birthday. I'm going to sit back and uh, play a few games. Finish Spider-Man off. Uh, Spider-Man 2. I'm going to platinum that. That's a guarantee. And, uh, and then... Play a bit of retro, I think, because I've got a fair few Japanese PS2 uh, titles down there. I want to have a go off. Um, and then I'll probably have a few beers, no doubt. That'll do me. But anyway, uh, if you're new to the channel as well, please do uh, stay uh, and hopefully enjoy the content I do in 2024. Check out the old content. Uh, it's not worth checking out, but I'm only, if you want to check it out, you're more than welcome. Um, but uh, regardless, it's great to be back. Uh, doing videos again and uh, let's see how 2024 pans out so as always i am cyber snake 7 keep playing and remember always keep watching all the best <laughs>